Jeff weighs 33 kilograms. And he's 4 kilograms lighter than Jeremy. How much does Jeremy weigh? Okay, my first question to you is, who is heavier, Jeff or Jeremy? Jeff is lighter, right? So Jeremy is heavier. So Jeremy weighs more than 33 kilograms. We know that, right? And um, our task here actually is to choose which one of these number sentences, these additions and subtractions, would match this problem. And notice there's these question marks. And that's my unknown. That's what I don't know. That's what the problem is asking. The problem asks, how much does Jeremy weigh? Question mark, okay? So Jeremy's weight is the number that would go here in place of the question mark. So let's see. 33 plus some number equals 4. Now if you add 33 in any number, it will be more than 33. You can't get 4 as an answer. Matty, cross that out, okay? It can't be that. How about the next one? 33 minus something equals 4. Okay, 33 minus what number would leave us 4? This is mental math now. 29 would go here, right? 33 minus 29 equals 4. But 29 cannot be the right answer because Jeremy weighs more than Jeff, more than 33. So 29 cannot be his weight. Math, cross that out too. 4 plus a number makes 33. Now, you probably can see that what fits here is 29 again, right? But we know 29 is not the answer. So let's cross that one out too. Oh, well. Let's try the last one. 33 plus 4 equals 37. And that's the right answer, right? I'm sure you already figured that out. 37 is the right answer. So this works. Now how about this one? Some number minus 4 equals 33. 37 works here too, doesn't it? 37 minus 4 equals 33. Yep, this one works too. Alright, we got that one done. 